Hi, Preston. Oh, okay. You, you first. Okay. I really enjoyed Chamber together. That was really fun and we were really productive and that was... I, I didn't like that, but we sounded good. Preston, you are my broski. <laughs> Thank you for everything. You've been there for me all the time. You, you, you're the best, Ben. Bye, Preston. I love your abs, too. I, what? <laughs> Hi Jennifer, Hi, this is Julia. And this is Christina, and um, we just wanted to tell you how much we've enjoyed being your friend all these years. Yeah, and well, this is my first year knowing you, but I really loved getting to know you and witnessing all of your hard work, all of your frantically taking my Shostakovich bowings and my fingerings. And then I really enjoyed being your roommate in Vienna last year. I had so much fun talking with you and Amber. It's been really great getting to know you this whole time. Yeah. We'll miss you a lot. Come visit. Love you, Jennifer. Hi. You're my platonic wife. I love you so much, and even though we're not dating, even if everyone thinks who does, you're an amazing best friend. I'm gonna miss you so much next year. We have to keep being each other's lending libraries for as long as we both exist in this world. Skyler, you brighten my day every time. I always love seeing you in Symphony Hall. What are we, Skyler? <laughs> Our best friends? I don't know, but I love you, and I'm gonna miss you so much. Whenever I hear the name David Balin, I think hero and mentor. Really strong player and he's always been a great member of our percussion section and of the orchestra as a whole and I know he's going to do really well in Arizona. Every day on the train he encourages me with his wise wisdom and his intelligence and he's a very talented percussion player. Hi. because you just, your aspirations are so high and you just break down these windows in front of you that hold you back. I think one of my favorite memories of the two of us was making that video of Yvonne when you jumped out and scared her. I will literally remember that for the rest of my life. I can't wait to go to the same school as you in a year. It'll be great. Eve La Puma. I think the first thing she said to me when I got here was, hey, do you want to like hang out? Do you want to sit with me? Oh, Eve, you're so sweet. And she's just so inclusive and an amazing bassoonist and just a dank person. Eve and I are basically the same person, so she's obviously perfect. It's been great lending books to you and just generally complaining about the world. I love you. <laughs> hey, Casita. Hi. I'm really glad I met you this year and got close with you and with Juliana and it was really fun. This yeah, year. you're really funny and you're a really good food player. And smart. Yeah, you got to be <laughs> That's pretty amazing. There you go. Have fun in college. Hi, Gemily. Hi, Gemily. I would like to say that I really enjoyed the time that we spent together during chamber rehearsal, where we just sat around and did nothing, and I got to listen to your life story and got to see where you're going to college. I'm really going to miss you, Gemily. I know you're going to go really far whenever you do, and I'm going to really miss our days in conservatory together, complaining, hanging around and stuff. So I'll really miss you. Good luck. Bye. Bye. Um, I've seen you grow up. We've been BFF since seventh grade. You introduced me to the school. Thank you so much for thinking of me. When we met when I was in like tenth grade, I think, during Symphonic Band, when you were in Symphonic Band, that, that was fun. I am really excited to go to college with you. I'm glad you're actually majoring in jazz because that's really cool. Because I've heard you're really good. You're a cool guy. To grow up with in symphony, so. You're lovely. You're sweet, petite, and lovely to meet. I love you so much, and you're just so amazing and such a great oboist and so sweet and strong, and it's just been great getting to know you this year, and yeah! Hi, Dana. It has been so much fun getting to know you over the past year and being in AP Econ with you and then complaining about AP Econ with you. When I first met you in AP Econ, I was like super psyched out. I'm really pleased that as I got to know you, I got to learn what a sweet, kind person you are. And uh, you've been a lot of help in statistics. And you know, I can only thank you for that. Hi, Sean. So I just want to say throughout my entire OSHA experience here, you have been probably among my greatest mentors, greatest friends, and just the most honest person I could ever, ever meet. Thank you for inspiring me to become a better musician. 
and not just a better musician, but a better person as well. Yeah, same here. Even though I'm not a cellist personally, but then I always see you practicing and you're very dedicated to your work and I truly respect that and I feel that it's really great. Thank you. We'll miss you. Bye. Okay, Mel, you are one of the craziest people I know, but like low-key crazy, and I, I love you for it. I, Symphony would not be the same without your impromptu birthday kazoo playing, or you attacking us as we come back from the restroom. Just nap time in Symphony Hall on the floor, your wild crazy cawing and bird noises. We it's been great. You. We love you. Charlotte, you're the most kind, caring, like genuinely compassionate person. I've ever met. You're so chill and always just really pleasant to be around. Like if I'm ever stressed, I'm just like being around you just calms everything down. Every day, you are such a genuine person and I don't know how you do it. Glad that we got to know each other in music theory. So that was really fun and I love your wardrobe obviously as most people do, so. I'm gonna miss you so much next year. Good luck next year in Santa Cruz. Hannah Kim, you are beautiful and I absolutely adore you and I love when we talk about weird things because you are beautifully weird and I love you and I love playing with your hair and I love going up to you and giving you big hugs because you deserve all of them. I love you too, Hannah Kim. <laughs> Hi, Hannah Kim. You're really a, like, a really big inspiration to me and like a really big role model. I haven't known you for that long, but I wish I knew you for like so much longer. Thing with it. Hannah Kim! It has been so great being able to fangirl over musicals with you for the past three years. I love having real talk with you and then poking you and then it's just so much fun because we have fun together and you're very, very nice and very cute and I'm happy. Being in A Push with you and having symphonic look with you with Mr. Russell was a lot of fun. Hey Sam, you're an awesome Sam partner. Whenever I would be feeling sad, talking to you would always make me feel better because you're super happy and you always say funny things. You're such a great person. You're gonna succeed at so many things. You have such a positive energy and you can just do whatever you set your mind to. Hi Sam, it's so great to have gotten to know you this year. It's been great having you in symphony and hearing your awesome flute and piccolo playing. You know I've known you since about sixth grade and ever since then I've seen a lot of personal uh, development and you've become a very intellectual, very kind uh, young man, which you know, I can't say for all of us sixth graders. Thank you for always having a positive attitude, for always being so kind and caring, and for being a blessing to others around you. Hi, Shelby. Hi. Hi. Yeah, hi. hi. We're really, oh, I'm really grateful no, for, too. for you being my sad partner and helping me through life and just listening to all the stuff that I have to say. Um, thank you for all those times we've talked and all the fun Punishing, punishing times we had. That was horrible. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, sure. Thank you, and I hope you have fun at eating this. Yeah. Bye. Hi, Miss Steve. I'm really glad that you came to OSHA last year, and I had a lot of fun being your stamp partner. Yeah, you came in the middle of your junior year. I feel like we've grown so close to become sis like sisters, and I'm gonna really miss our deep talks and your rants about everything. Even though it's only been a year and a half of me knowing you, you've made a really great impact on my life, and I'm going to really miss you next year. Come back and visit, and let's hang out, yeah. I love you. Love you, Misty!